too long ago. I was here in this living room pouring my coffee. I had gotten up like the servant of Elisha and I had said, what am I to do? How is this going to work? Is, this, is, is, is it even possible? What was I in the middle of? Unemployment at the time. Diabetic complications at the time. T1D levels going all over the map. I mean, my health was, I was struggling with my health. I was struggling with employment. I was, I was, there were bad breaks upon bad breaks. And I got up and I looked at everything surrounding me and I said, how am I going to do it? Is this, is this even possible? And I poured my coffee and I'm praying and I'm laying it out before the Lord. And I'm begging him, God, would you help me? Lord, would you help me? Please, please, God, I need you. And you know what? Spending time with the Lord filled my heart with hope. He unleashed love. And you know what he said? He said this, three words. I love you. I love you. And I wish you knew what that did in my soul. To get a sensing from God the Father. Jesus loves you. Jesus loves you. As I sip my coffee. He's not just filling, my cup's not just full of coffee. My soul is full of hope in that moment, knowing that it's going to work, Ryan, in your favor. It's going to work in your favor. Here, here's, here's what Elisha said. Let me remind you, it's going to work in your favor. He said, don't worry about it. Jesus loves you. There are more on our side than on their side. Now, I don't know what you're going through. Some of you I do, but others watching, I may not know what you're going through. But the Lord is coming in His fire, with His fire. You've got fire power on your side. This morning, I read it in, in, in Isaiah again. Even Isaiah, this scripture has a meta narrative in Isaiah where Isaiah said, And His chariots, and His chariots are of fire and his chariots surround you. The psalmist said it this way. The psalmist said his chariots are a whirlwind. Do you know how many chariots it would take to create a whirlwind? Well, the psalmist says his chariots are tens of thousands and thousands upon thousands. What is he saying? He's, he, got a, he got a picture. He had coffee with Jesus. He had a picture of what God is and who God is and that it's going to work in your favor. And he does this. He says his chariots of fire are what? Are surrounding you. So you may be surrounded this morning by a really bad break like I had, okay? But I wanna, I wanna tell you what the Lord told me. I wanna remind you, just as Elisha told his servant, did you know that wasn't the first time Elisha had seen chariots of fire? If you go back to the second chapter in 2 Kings, you'll read about how Elisha uh, uh, was with Elijah and they were walking and they were talking and then what happened? All of a sudden, a whirlwind of chariots of fire took Elijah up. And so Elisha has seen, he has past experience to say this, it's going to be okay. It's going to work in your favor. And today I stand here with my coffee cup in hand to tell you not too long ago in this living room, I didn't know how it was going to work. I didn't know how it was going to turn out. I was pretty discouraged, but you know what? The Lord gave me a vision and he said, I love you. Jesus loves you this morning, and I pray you can see, just as I've seen, not, not, not the first or second time, but God has been faithful through all the years. He will work it in your favor.